Hello everybody and welcome back to GSP Sea Fishing and in this video I'm just going to show you a quick little hack with safety pins. They have a couple of uses. One is really handy if uh, you snap the tip of your rod but we'll get to that in a minute. The first use for a safety pin is to keep some of your terminal tackle on especially if you're fishing light. If you're wading out and you've just got chest waders on and you've got nothing else to put any small bits of terminal tackle on you can use a safety pin so what you want to do is with your safety pin you're basically using it as a holder so you can open your safety pin here I want to take out some lead clips lead link clips so I'm going to thread them on there like so and I can take three of those out with me I can keep them there and what I can do with that is I can then get another safety pin and I want to take some swivels out with me, beaded swivels. So I can just thread them on like so. Again, like that. Clip that all up. I then want to take some hooks out with me. I've got a selection of hooks there. Never know, I might snag on something I want to take some hooks with me so I can thread them on the safety pin like that and then you can keep all of these together and you can go through the eye the bottom of the safety pin and then like I said if you're wading you can then just clip that through the braces on your waders um, if you're going really light and you just want a few bits of equipment like that you can clip them on the strap of a small bag or something along those lines and then you can just attach that on clip that shut and you'll have all the gear that you need to take with you but then when this comes into its own the safety pin is when an accident occurs so it happens when you're fishing and you end up snapping the tip of your rod. Now, in an emergency, the safety pin is a great tip guide. It will get you through a session. Depending on the size of the rod, if you've got beach cast, you want to get a large safety pin with a large eye, getting towards 10 mil. And then what you basically do is you can cut like that with a pair of pliers, which most people take with them. And I would also cut the pin off like so that gives you that you can then push them together you have that the last thing to do is put the two ends in there fold that around at a 90 degree there we have it then with some black electrical tape like so you can take that to the tip of your rod And in an emergency, this will see you through a session. Nothing worse than snapping the tip of your rod and the tip guide off when you've just turned up. Doesn't take a lot. Bit of line wrap on a rusty old guide that you haven't washed. But then with a safety pin, you've then got a guide that will last you for your session. You won't be able to fish for, with this for a long period of time, but for one session, this should do the trick. So there we have it, the safety pin. Great for keeping together all of your terminal tackle. If you don't want to carry an accessory box around or you're wading out, you're going really light, you only want a few bits, use your safety pin. And then it doubles up as an emergency tip guide if anything was to happen to your tip which believe me it can so it's always good to have a backup and it's always good to have an item that you can utilize for many different things anyway i hope this little hack has helped until next time tight lines